Much. It's coming up on 632. One of the men accused of stealing millions of dollars from Tony Busby's home here in Houston is due back in court later this morning. Janelle Ford is live outside the courthouse. Janelle, he had a new message for Houston overnight. Yeah, that's right. Russ and Lisa, the mayoral hopeful, posted to Facebook overnight thanking HPD for making those arrests. Uh, we first broke this story to you guys last night. Three months after Busby's River Oaks home was burglarized, he's now saying that three people have been arrested in this case. Now we know the names of two of those men. Here are brand new mugshots of the pair. Police say Nicholas Johnson on the left of your screen and Julian Franklin on the right. So more than $5 million worth of paintings, guns, jewelry, and electronics from Busby's home. Johnson is expected to be in court this morning. According to court documents, police were able to track them down because Franklin tried selling one of Busby's Rolexes to a drug dealing friend who turned on him. Authorities say the woman got Busby's number, sent him photos of his stolen stuff and helped police catch the pair. Now Busby says he expects to get most or many of those big ticket items back, but he worries that the one that he wants the most, his Aggie ring may be gone forever. Sending it back to you guys in the studio. All right, Janelle Ford, thank you. You're right.